welcome to my hometown of Logie Bay, Middle Cove, Outer Cove, Newfoundland, and Labrador. Clearly, there's been some amalgamation. When I was growing up here, just over that hill, I always believed that the building behind me was owned by a Bond villain, or perhaps an eccentric Hollywood movie star. Turns out the truth is far more interesting. This is Memorial University's Ocean Sciences Center. Inside, a great big sea of knowledge awaits. And this is Danielle Nichols, and she knows everything there is to know about the Ocean Sciences Center. Hello, Danielle. How are you? Nice to see you, Rick. Thank you for having me. Now, because this is operated by the university, it's essentially a research facility. It's an educational facility, but the public come as well. Correct. We uh, have people come every summer, upwards of 20,000 people. It's a free program offered by the university, and it's great. They can come in and touch everything in our touch tanks and visit the seals. And the seals eat, I believe, it's 85,000 pounds of cod a day, so it's... <laughs> It's a big job feeding them. So this here is a scallop. Oh. So you can see it all has all these little black spots. That is its eyes. Okay, look. Oh, I know what this is. This is a fascinator for the royal wedding. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. Now, is it normal that he's got that growing on there? Uh, that's just a, no, he's not growing on. So he has tube feet, little suction cups, yeah. and he can stick to the side and have other things stick to him. Because he might want to get that removed. So that hermit crab, he moved into this shell. That's not his shell. He moved into the shell and made it his home, correct? Exactly, and yeah. he will move out as he gets bigger to He's bigger a shells. squatter. The incredibly rare, hardly ever seen, no exaggeration, one in a million, <laughs> blue lobster. It's a normal uh, North American lobster, but he happens to oh, be blue. Oh, oh, it got me. Oh, oh, ow, 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 I mean. <laughs> Did you see that? Wow, that was something. <laughs> but that's good luck. Get bitten by a blue lobster. That is good luck. So that's a sea anemone. If you touch it, it actually has nematocyte cells, so it has stinging cells like a jellyfish. Then why would I touch it? It doesn't hurt us. It only hurts fish, but not clownfish, because, of course, Nemo lived in a sea anemone. <laughs> Okay. Every weekend we have a volunteer program for people to come in and help us with the seal So when care. I retire to this glorious province, I could be a seal volunteer? You could. We'll see how you do today. Okay. And this is research assistant Kirsten Cormier. Hello, Kirsten, how are you? Good. And I will be the research assistant's assistant today. <laughs> Correct? Correct. How many seals are there? There's three seals. Are these the same seals that were around when I was in high school? They are, yep. Really, eh? Yep. Now, when I was in school, you could come down and you could park in that parking lot at one o'clock in the morning and you could just go up to the fence and look at the seals. Yeah, you can still do that. We have our viewing deck here. So at one in the morning? Place. Yeah. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? This is our first seal, Babs. Oh. She's our oldest. She's about 38 years old. Hello, Babs. Will she bite? <laughs> She does bite, yeah. Oh, <laughs> that didn't come up in the briefing. <laughs> it did, yeah. Oh, I wasn't listening. <laughs> Again. Hey, Babs. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Why did she do that? <laughs> it looks like fish. She thinks this is fish. Yep. It's an iPhone 6, Babs. <laughs> now, what kind of seal is Babs? Babs is a harp seal. And why are they called harp seals? Uh, they get their name from their markings on their back. So if you look at her back, you'll see really? a nice horseshoe shape, and that is the harp. Oh, right, Babs got back tattoos. <laughs> Saucy lower back tattoos. What's next? So next, we're going to go get Dini, Babs' daughter, and <laughs> we're going to put her in the tank as well. I'm sorry. I was playing with my gloves. <laughs> We have our Virgil stick here. That's the worst back scratcher ever. What is that? The seal is trained to put their nose on the baton, and that's how we lead them around. Look at you. You're pretty impressive. And then right to the water? Yeah. If you take your fish, yeah. hold it up straight like this. Yeah. And then when it's horizontal, they'll take it. OK, so standard communion rules. Yes. Vertical fish is mine, horizontal fish is theirs. This is mine. Yep. Horizontal's yours. Oh, <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry, I swore. Head first. What? Give it to them head first. Oh, my God, don't go back in. <laughs> oh, God. Just wait. OK, I'm panicking. God Just almighty, they're voracious. Yeah. Go back. Step back for a Calm second. Calm down. Everyone back away. <laughs> Oh my God, it's like last call or something, and the lights are flickering. Want to try it again? Yes. Okay. This way is mine. Now it's yours. Perfect. And look, they go back. 
<laughs> and they just suck those babies in, don't they? Yep. I can't even swallow a grab all hole. Stop. <laughs> you see, that was like I had a superpower. <laughs> Away. Oh, like Darth Vader of Seals. Okay, who do we have here? So this is Tyler. Hello, Tyler. Oh, gentle. Oh, I was just bit by a seal. <laughs> Go. I'm like Heather McCartney. You like to be. Is she coming after you? Yes. Eek. Can she? Uh, elbows off the table. <laughs> How about we switch spots so she'll bite me and not you? Yeah. Take her. <laughs> Career over. <laughs> Eat the scientist, not the TV boy. <laughs> okay, now it's mine. Now it's yours. And away. That's mine. Now it's yours. Away. Come on, buddy. I shouldn't be afraid, right? <laughs> no. No. The way this seal is looking at me, it's like, it's like he knows what my great grandfather's occupation was. <laughs> nice one. There's only one more thing I want to do. Yep. Can I get in the tank? Only if you do exactly as I say. Yes! Really? Really. Not what I had in mind. 